Hello everybody and happy Thursday. Exactly 3.39 in the afternoon, UK time, March 17, 2022. We're on a roll guys. We're really enjoying this, especially when the sun's out. We got natural lighting for our videos, so that's even better. So here we go, another uh, Osborne Phonics Readers entitled Goose on the Loose. Bless you, baby. Support Synthetic Phonics Learning by Phil Roxby Cox and Stephen Cartwright. So just like the other one we read, we've got information here about uh, what synthetic phonics mean according to Dr. Grant. So if you'd like to read more, just pause the video and by all means read during your free time. Here we go. Goose is on a scooter. She can't stay and play. She's a goose on the loose. Get out of my way. Honk. She almost runs down Rooster Ron. Get out of my way. Goose goes scooting on. Honk. Honk. Goose is scooting to Ted's shed. Look out behind you! Watch out, Ted! Ted ends up in his flower bed. Oh dear. Poor Ted. Goose goes scooting down the road. She almost scoots right into Toad. Toad groans and drops a heavy load. Groan! The cows all moo. The doves all coo. The brown owl says, to it, to woo, to it, to woo. Now go, now goose is heading for the zoo. Look out! Goose is on the loose! She upsets a bunch of kangaroos and shocks a flock of cockatoos and shocks a flock of cockatoos
There are shouts of hiss and shouts of boo. Then snarls and howls and a hula baloo. Goose must be stopped. What shall we do? But Goose has stopped and feels a fool. She's landed in the penguin pool. Oh dear. And that's it. And here's the others if you're keen on finding them in the shops or in charity shops, bookshops or in the public library. So again, thank you very much and uh, we'll see you very soon. We might be reading a few more since the weather is really good today. So see you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take care.